I'm going to show you how you can enable the deletion confirmation box on Windows 11. So by default in Windows 11, when you delete any types of files or folders, it just deletes them. It doesn't pop up a box saying, are you sure? So if I just delete these, they're gone. However, if you right click the recycle bin and then go to properties and then display delete confirmation dialog and then apply. Now, when we try and delete any files or folders, it says, are you sure? And then we can press yes to delete them or no to not delete them. Now, the only time that's really different is if you've got a shared drive. So by default, even if the display delete confirmation dialog is disabled, if you try and delete a file or folder out of a shared drive, it will still ask you if you want to permanently delete it because it doesn't go to the recycle bin on the local machine. It gets just deleted from the file share. Now, this has never really been a problem for us until we've recently started using OneDrive more. Now, because OneDrive files are stored locally in like the desktop or the documents folder, this display delete confirmation dialog box needs to be enabled. Otherwise, people just keep deleting files and then it doesn't pop up and then they can never seem to figure out how to get them back. So to push this change to all of your workstations is deploy it via group policy. So I'm on my domain controller. And if we open up the group policy management, what we can do is we can create a new group policy object and I'll call this enable delete confirmation. And then okay. So we've got our group policy object. If we then right click and edit and then drill down to user configuration, policies, administrative templates, windows components, file explorer, and then if we sort by the name being alphabetical order, we can find display confirmation dialog when deleting files, and then we can just double click, set that to enabled, apply and okay. And then we can close our group policy editor. So now we've got our group policy object, which will enable the display confirmation dialog when deleting files. Now, as this is a user configuration, we need to apply this to users. So in my Active Directory structure, all of my users are stored within a single OU, and that's broken down into various departmental locations. But if I just drag this enable delete confirmation over my users OU, that will filter down to all of the users. So we can see that that is now linked. So if we come back to our Windows 11 workstation, and then if we just check, we see that is disabled. And then if we run a GP update, just to force it through. Now, normally you would just leave this and then it would automatically apply the next time the user reboots or the group policy automatically updates. So that is now updated. So if I check my recycle bin again now, we can see it is enabled and it's been grayed out. So the user has no way of changing it. Now, just to check that works, if we come to, for instance, documents and then create a new folder, and a new file and then if we try and delete it it now asks us do we want to remove them to the recycle bin and then the user has got some confirmation to either press yes or no so that's how you can enable the recycle bin confirmation on windows 11 using group policy